Okay, good morning. This is Carl F. Rose, recording on Monday, uh, November 4th, 2019. And let me, before we get going, let's do this. Okay, all right. Um, uh, yeah, okay. Um, not sure how that came out, but um, we'll just see how it works. Anyway, um, today's uh, podcast is about uh, uh, the win uh, the Buffalo Bills had over um, the Washington team yesterday um, on uh, Sunday, uh, the November uh, 3rd, 2019. Anyway, uh, the victory was good. Um, there were some good, bad, and ugly. That uh, uh, I I predicted the score to be 27, uh, 27 to seventeen with a Buffalo win. Actually, their defense played a pretty good game, but there are f- some flaws. Um, they actually the final score was only uh, uh, twenty four to nine. Uh, so score wise, yes, the uh, the Buffalo Bills did not let uh, the Washington team into the the end zone, uh, which is good. Um, actually, my prediction was really close. Um, I was only three points off on, on the Buffalo's uh, Bills. Uh, they could be doing better on offense, but their running game, they finally won the game by, with their running game. Uh, Singletary they used, and then they dropped off. Uh, I don't know why during the game they they dropped him off for a while. It almost cost them the game. Um, he was doing good. Then they stopped using him. Um, the Washington team made a game of it. Um, then they brought him back in and they, they sealed the deal. Uh, the biggest flaw that I see with the, with the Buffalo team right now is on their defense, even though they, they only allowed nine points and they didn't let the Washington team in. They have got to do something and they have the players to do it. They have got to be able to stop the run. Um, Adrian Peterson had over 100 yards rushing. They've got and and uh, you know hats off. I I got to give Adrian Peterson um, a tip my hat to him. I mean he ran his heart out. So um, uh, so give him credit for for doing what he did. Um, especially at being 34 or something like that, whatever his age is. But he, he, you, you got to give him credit. But um, uh, Buffalo is going to be facing, and they got Cleveland. I think Cleveland is their next game with, with Chubb. Uh, and Cleveland will get in the end zone if they don't stop the run. And and you, you know, with, with the Patriots coming up, uh, you know Bill Belichick is making a note on this. And... Uh, if they continue to allow the yards on the ground that they're doing, um, uh, it won't be Tom Brady that will uh, beat Buffalo. It will be their ground game because uh, Bill Belichick is the master. He's probably the greatest coach of all time. So he knows their flaws. So if they don't fix this run, this running defense, I guarantee you that New England will, will just dominate because it's going to be in their, in their house, and uh, they will run. Um, uh, he adjusts to to uh, every team, and he he knows their, their weaknesses. So Buffalo has really got to, uh, and um, uh, the the coach addressed this against um, uh, prior to the Washington game yesterday. But they still didn't step up. But they did. The only thing that I can give them credit on is that they didn't let them get into the end zone, which is good. They only allowed them three field goals. Um, Offensively wise, yes, they've picked it up. They they're running the ball better, but they need to. Um, they really need to score more points. Um, um, and they they got away from like I said a minute ago. They got away from Singletary. Then they they started um, uh, letting uh, Josh Allen uh, uh, use his arm more. He you know when they start passing a lot, uh, you know Josh Allen is going to be a good quarterback in this year, but in this league. Um, but he's not there yet. He's not the real gunslinger. And you really, in order to win in the NFL, you don't need the gunslinger. You don't need the quarterback to get 5,000 yards, um, a season. Um, it's a, the league is a running league. Um, 
the the Bills have the backs with Singletary and Gore. Uh, they they used Gore. Uh, um, you know, he didn't get a lot of yards, but there were times when they used Gore when they should have used Singletary. Um, and uh, Gore is, you know, he's he, you know, he's uh, is uh, he's up there with with uh, like with Peterson and um, um, but Peterson had a better game than Gore. But uh, Singletary, he, he he did it when they when they used him right. He was doing it for him. But the thing went away from it, and that's the only reason the game was even close. Uh, I think Buffalo could have scored, could have and should have scored more than twenty four points um, in the game. They they kind of let off the, the the gas there, and then they realized that um, the, the game was getting a little bit. Um, uh, uncomfortable so they they went back to what they were doing um so it, it wasn't a it wasn't a pretty uh win and i really wasn't expecting it this was kind of a trap game which they very easily could have lost um because you know the washington team is hungry um they're one and eight and um uh you know and, and um uh this this um it should have been the score. It should have been a little more lopsided, actually, um, but they got the win. So anyway, um, uh, if you like these videos, um, uh, if you're listening to this on my YouTube channel, go to my homepage and uh, check uh, because I do uh, this is on my podcast. Go to my homepage. Uh, um, be sure to hit the bell notification and the subscribe button. Then on my homepage, I have Carl's Corner podcast. Where, where my podcast is hosting. Uh, go into that, go into that channel, um, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification there, and I'll be sure to go into the playlist because I, I, I've created a new Buffalo playlist, uh, or I am working on it. Um, and um, so go in there, and uh, I got a playlist for, for other things, uh, other sports and that sort of thing. So anyway, I just wanted to get this podcast out, give my review, on this, um, I'm going to be doing some more uh, during the week kind of stuff and going to things on um, uh, what I think the, the bill should or should should not do, that sort of thing, um, any kind of player updates and that sort of thing. Anyway, I just wanted to sign off, and uh, we will talk to you uh, next time. And uh, this Okay, um, and we will see you again. Talk to you later.